Hi everyone, so Microsoft has recently launched the newer version of their Pi model, large language model series, which is Pi 2. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can run that Pi 2 on your machine with fully metal support by using the Rust language. And as you can see, it is already running on my laptop over here. So let's start the video. Please make sure you follow this video step by step because there will be a lot of things will be going on. We'll be installing Cargo, we'll be cloning the repo of Candle, which is the machine learning library provided by Hugging Face for Rust language. Then we are going to build it and then we are going to run it. So let's start the video. We'll keep it simple step by step. So first thing you have to do will be installing the Cargo. So Cargo will we'll be using Cargo in order to build the Rust code. So what you have to do, go in the description below. You're going to get this particular link. Uh, you can easily search for it also by just saying install install cargo mac and the first link will be this anyway still i'm going to leave the link in below down description so what you have to do just copy this particular link and then open your terminal and you just have to paste the link over here and after downloading all of this and installing and all you're going to get a message rust is now installed great and in my in my case also i got this particular message just have to copy the command and run it you should be good to go now once the cargo is installed, you have to change the directory to wherever you want to install your file model, wherever you want to run your file model. So I'm going to change the directory to document development LLMs. So I'm going to download the code in this particular directory over here, but you can change it wherever you want to. Now you're going to need to clone the candle repository. So you can search for GitHub candle and the first link you are going to get, just click on the code, copy the link and get in over here just say git clone and paste the url over here now after a few seconds depending on your internet connection the code will be downloaded if you ls then you will have a directory called candle just change the directory to candle just like that let's clear the screen now if we ls we are going to have a lot of files obviously now you are going to go in down description you are going to get a command called cargo build dash dash example phi dash dash release and in this is important you have to say dash dash features metal all right now if you are using uh, nvidia drivers you can replace it with cuda but i am using mac m1 so i'm going to say metal and you can remove if you want to run it on cpu now just press enter and it's going to build the binary for phi in order to run it it's going to take some time few minutes all right finally it is compiled and it took four minutes on my machine and it has used all the core of my CPU. All right, it is worth the time you're going to see. Now, if you LS, you're going to have a new directory called target. You just have to change the directory CD to target release examples. Now, if you LS, you're going to have a binary called phi. Now, we are going to use this binary in order to run our model. You have to say phi, then dash dash prompt. Now, this is here, you provide your prompt. So I'm going to say, hello, how are you? And I'm going to wait for assist reply now you can change the prompt whatever you want to now this is important in order to use the phi 2 model you have to say phi 2 otherwise you can say phi 1.5 if you want to use 1.5 model we are going to say phi 2 model will be used now this is again important you have to use the quantized here otherwise it is going to download the full model but we, are, we want to run the quantized model on our metal since we have compiled the code with the metal feature on now if you run now it started producing the prompt it is generating six about six token per second and it was pretty fast now let's try to give it a bigger prompt to it and see how long does it take okay so i just asked it to write a story about a person who started a youtube channel and got success um let's hit enter and wait what it generate all right now if you want to see more uh, parameter more argument you can pass you just have to say phi dash dash help in order to see all the parameters you can arguments you can pass so if you want to run on cpu you can say dash dash cpu there is a tracing uh, there is prompt which we are already using there is a temperature the p value the seed the length the model which we are using two over here here is the quantized version which we are using so currently the sample length is set to 100 so let's copy this particular argument or you can say dash n and just provide how long uh, output you want so i'm going to say 1000 tokens and hit enter and this time it is going to generate a bigger story maybe all right so this is it for this video if you still got any error while following this video while installing or, or while running this model fight v2 model you can ask them down in comment section so maybe if anyone know the answer they could respond or i'll just search out google for helping you so this is it for this video if you found this video helpful please make sure to drop a like button and subscribe for more such videos